How's it going everyone? Deviate back again with the second episode of Invincible. Uh, the first one threw me for a loop. I thought it was just like your basic first episode where, you know, where a father's teaching his son how to be a superhero. You know, it kind of gave me that sky high vibe, you know, because he didn't have powers, then he did, and then he was like all ecstatic about it. And then like the last, I want to say like maybe five minutes of the episode, things went south. I, I, I gotta say, it's been like a few days since I watched the first episode and I haven't stopped thinking about it. Like the carnage, like the savageness of, um, I can't think of his name right now. I'm, I'm sure you guys are going to roast me in the comments, but, uh, it's, a. Uh, I couldn't believe what I was seeing. Like he just tore them apart. So I really like to know what made him snap. He, he also did seem kind of sketchy about, you know, his son getting powers for some reason. Like he seemed like he was happy, but not happy about it. So I wonder what's up with that. So, I don't know. So let's get into it, and uh, we'll see what the hell this show's all about. I'm very, very curious now what the hell's this dude's problem. <laughs> J. Jonah Jameson got himself some superpowers, and he's real happy about it. Uh, all right, but without further ado, let's go. Yeah, that happened. Jesus. Omni Man. Now. Fucking internal stabilizer. Omni Man's alive. Get out of the way. This is traitor. That's all we can do here. Get ready. I'm sorry, but are they gonna actually revive these people? Probably used to waking up alone. Omni Man is always out, supposedly saving the world, but looks like he had a bad day. Okay, so I'm seeing a running theme here. Every time they mention his okay, name, right? first time in the episode, it's the so. time for the title card. Doctors Last episode was like best. in the middle of the but damn episode. Don't get a lot of filter mites in here. Who did this? We have no idea. All right, so we get to see our man go out solo. All right, these aliens there. brought their own soundtrack. Stop! Get away from those people! What? Jeez. Oh shit! Oh my god! Uh. How is this? I don't know who you are, but it's time to go. Duplicate? Alright, so at least we got some other heroes to take care of this. Place. Keep doing what you are doing. You! Get her to a hospital! We can handle this! Admirable intention, Mina, but I am not positive we can handle this. This is like this universe's Iron Man, right? <laughs> what the hell? I don't know what just happened. I think I. I speak for everyone here when I say I never want it to happen ever again. It's okay. I mean, could you clean up a little bit before you even like put blood all over the bed and stuff? I mean, I'm not trying to be in, not sympathetic, but uh, hey. still, you know. Hey. Oxidized and corroded. For an alloy like this, that should take years. Time runs faster wherever they come from. They ran off because, because they, they were, were dying of old age. How did that new kid do? Invincible? He has promise, but he seems unprepared for the more realistic aspects of superhero. Oh, well, he'd better toughen up. We're gonna need his help. Why? Wasn't hiding. 
So we got a Hellboy in here too, a Hellboy detective. Sir, who the Damien hell? Darkblood, demon detective. That's pretty cool. Fine. What if he finds any of with the Omni Man's blood? I thought you were Can an atheist. see dog. that they were Fifth attacking field, him. Right? Try to keep up. Let's try this again. Things are gonna get gruesome by the end of this episode. Man. Again, watch. Uh oh, competition. Oh hey, it's the Ice Man. Rex. Couldn't have won that fight without you. Oh, except we did. Guess who's back? Okay, robot. That's gotta be the laziest name I've ever heard for a character. They're back to get old again. Are these like all their grandchildren at this point? Why aren't they getting old? Who cares? I bet their bones still break. <laughs> so do ours. Oh, this ain't gonna go well. This is not gonna go like yeah. last time. Oh shit! Oh, here we go. So she's kind of like a Green Lantern almost. Nifty. Oh, that's not good. All right. All right. And here he goes. Oh, you're gonna get old now. So destroy everyone's wristbands. Bloody boy! <laughs> I'll be back. Right back at you, buddy. Dude, Way you're a dick. Psycho there, invincible. Uh, can I get a massage? Anybody? This guy needs to shut the fuck up. Everything okay. I feel like he's like a Johnny Cage oh, no, type character. This up near Mars an hour ago, moving fast. He's back. 15 minutes till he's breathing our air. I wouldn't ask, Nolan. But with the Guardians gone... I'll stop him. Who's he? Nolan's been home a week. And you want to send him to space? No. No way. Could you define not that tough? Just knock some sense into the guy and throw him back where he came from. Easy. How do I breathe in space? That's the neat thing. You don't. Dude, this guy looks fucking lame. You shaved your mustache. Stay away from my planet. All right. Why can I hear you in my head? Where else do you keep your brain? No. No. Not the same guy. Well, sucks to be you then. <laughs> it's kind of a big target. Time out? You get a time out? <laughs> Why do I get a time out? Hey, I didn't invent the rules. What rules? I don't even know who you are. Oh, you don't? Yeah, who is, or are you? Let's hear it. Not who No. Is that with a T or a U? E. Oh, I'm in so much trouble. Well, thanks for letting <laughs> me know. I'm Alan, by the way. Invincible. Oh my god, not again. Because she found some old photos of me, okay? Photos she said she'd delete if I did this one stupid thing and then never talk to you again. There. Have a crappy life with her. That suck. <laughs> that was the weirdest confrontation my ever. Todd? Don't push your luck, Grayson. Oh my god, these people again. I have 
bad news. Oh, robots got bad news, everybody. Dude, this guy Did needs to get killed this hey, time. Robot, what's the bad news? There are too many of them. Their technology has advanced too far, and they've rendered themselves immune to our time stream. <laughs> Oh, that guy's really pissed. This guy looks like he's trying to dress like Thor. So even though he's invincible, I wonder how much that shit actually hurts, though. Alright, well, are you gonna go psycho again? Ow. <laughs> I mean, he's powerful. Oh shit, no one's watching him right now. I'm about to see something wild right now. You know shit's about to go down when everything's red. Okay. Oh, the time flies a lot faster there. Okay. I need a shower. Dad! Alright, so a lot to unpack there. So uh our man Mark, invincible. Grayson got himself on, you know, at least introduced into a new little team and, uh, you know, got a little pink, little hottie, got an annoying boyfriend that is either going to be killed soon or he's going to be a lasting character. That's going to be the comic relief. That's just always running his damn mouth. Um, robot. It's pretty cool. Very, very handy with all the stuff that he can do so far of what I've seen. Um, you know, he resynced all their bracelets. You know, it's your basic. I, I feel like he's, a, you know, an Iron Man stand-in. I hate his name, Robot. I'm sorry. Um, maybe you guys are fans of that character, and I'm sure I will be a fan of his. But that's not escaping the fact that his name is lazy. Okay, I'm sorry. But um, old man Omni. He's something else, isn't he? Like, uh, I mean, I know people are comparing him in like the upper ranks along with Superman, possibly Goku, uh, you know, One Punch Man. He's like you know, top tier strong people. You know, he, it looks like he took a while to destroy that. I mean, he looks like he was trying to destroy that planet. Um, Judge, judging by what I saw, it looked like it, he was there for a long enough time to grow facial hair. That seems like he was there for like a few weeks or so, you know, tearing up their planet. And uh, judging by that feat right there, I would say that he is not as strong as Goku or Superman or... Well, I'm not sure about He-Man yet. I'll get back to you on that one. I'm not sure how strong He-Man is compared to the other guys either. Um, He-Man is pretty strong, um, but uh, I have to do a little bit more re research on that before I touch on that subject with Omni-Man. Um, but yeah, I know Goku can obliterate a planet. I mean, he doesn't. We've never seen him do it, but we know he's very much capable of it. If he can take down people that are capable of it, he's capable of it, but he's just not an asshole. Uh, Superman, he probably could too. He has the power to move planets. If you can, if you're strong enough to move planets, you can definitely fly through one and explode one. I mean, Superman is strong enough to destroy a planet at will as well. All he has to do is just punch one hard enough and done. You know. Uh, last video, I reached out. You know, I, I called out to my fellow reactors. You know, with certain movies that I've never seen them react to and whatnot. 
I have another suggestion today. Some people have responded, have reacted to this one, but not a lot of people. And this is a really great movie. So here it is. This is Face Off. Uh, everyone loves a little bit of Nicolas Cage. I mean, he's crazy as all hell now, but this is back when like his career was like at its peak right here. And you know, John Travolta, I mean, I'm not gonna give away this movie. It's called Face Off and uh, it's not about hockey. I'll tell you that much. I'll tell you what it's not. It's not about hockey. So, um, well, I'm gonna wrap up this video now. Like, comment, and subscribe. Let me know what you all thought. And uh, I'll catch you next time for the next episode, all right? Peace.